In today's video, I will be reviewing Prism's Live Studio software. Prism is an upgraded version of OBS. It has many different features for your streams. They are a sponsor of this video, but I will be giving my honest review of their program. Let's get right into it. The download process is super simple to do. Just go to prismlive.com and then you're just going to click on the download button. Unfortunately, they only support Windows at the moment, but soon they will be supporting Mac OS as well. Once it is finally installed, all you're going to do is click on start. Now you are going to have to make an account with prism but as you can see you can log in with virtually any platform now like i said it is a improved version of obs so you will probably see a lot of similarities the first thing we're going to start off with is prism's multi-streaming feature what that means is is if you want to stream on twitch youtube kick all at the same time you're able to do so you just go up to the top bar and then whatever account you would want to add you can do so here so for an example if i want to stream on youtube all i'm going to do is go up to youtube and click on it. and then you're just going to click on whatever account you want to stream with and then authorize prism and then at the top bar your channel will show up there and then if you want to add any other platforms you're just going to go to my channel and then just simply click on add channels and then here you can add whatever account you want to also if you stream on kick you would just click on add a custom channel and here is where you would add all your information another cool thing about prism is their sidebar the top three icons above are your normal features such as your chat or notifications but what's really interesting is the icons below. What we're going to talk about is the prism lens, which is the icon here. It's really easy to set up as well. All you're going to do is go to their website and download it. Once you have prism lens downloaded, it is super easy to install. Just one click like before. You can do anything with your camera, such as changing your background or adding a beauty effect to your face, which could be beneficial for your streams. Another awesome thing that you can do is have a drawing mode. What the drawing mode is, is that if you ever want want to highlight something on your stream or draw something on your stream you can do that here another cool thing that you can do is add stickers or gifs to your stream all i would do is click on one of these icons and then select whatever picture or gif you would want to use and as you can see it adds it straight to your stream another fun thing that you can do is add a music playlist to your stream what this does is whatever music that you're playing on your stream it will pop up on your stream all i would do is click on add source name it whatever you'd like but i keep it as as music playlist and then you're just going to click on add and edit then add music and here is where you can select whatever music you would like prism also includes their free music playlist which is copyright free finally the last interesting feature that i like about prism is that you can use your phone as a stream deck all you're going to want to do is go to your phone store and then download the prism mobile app if you want to learn anything about stream and audio settings go check out my channel i have everything there just for you if you want to learn more about prism their link is in the description below so please be sure to go check them out other than that be sure to drop a like down below and subscribe to the channel i hope you all have a good day see you guys later peace out